They're giving them drugs to make them sleep, to keep them quiet. This is four-year-old Lane Luviano. She's the one that broke this case open in September when she snuck one of her sleepy stickers out of the classroom. She kind of pulled up her little shorts and said, Mom, look, this is my sleeping sticker. And I was like, the what? When Lane's mom, Lisa, saw the sticker, she thought it was strange and asked her daughter about it. And the teacher gives it to you where she put it? On my arm. On your arm? Which part? Point to it. Right up there? Yeah. Lane's dad says he's known something was wrong since school first started. Two o'clock in the morning, I'm hearing her. The room, some noise in the room, and I'm going over there. She's still up. And so she gives you the sticker. You put the sticker on, and it makes you tired. Yeah. I showed it to my four-year-old, um, and she said, "Yes, that's." That's the sleepy sticker. Melissa Guilford immediately went online to research the sticker. Sleep Z patch. Mm. Okay, so and if you read the ingredients on them, it has a lot of, I mean, it's just things I've never even heard of. Najala Abdullah tells us she'd noticed changes in her son who told her he'd been getting the stickers too. She says he'd been crying, stopped eating, and was bringing home lunches that he hadn't touched. The parents shared with us an email they received from Northgate Crossing Elementary's principal today. The email states two of the school staff members were put on leave after they allegedly administered sleeping supplements to students on September 24th. This spring, ISD Police Department is investigating.